All right, let's what? talk about over-controlling to get away from control, or over-chaosing to get away from chaos, or over-negativity to get away from negativity, right? So this is <laughs> Rich Rebuilds. I saw him on the Joe Rogan thing, right? He, so he's a guy that, he's obviously smart. You can tell by the glasses. So he has a Tesla that he made into a gas-powered Tesla, or, you know, put a racing engine, a gas engine in a, in a Tesla. So why would you do that? Well, yeah, it's because he's that? complaining about Teslas too controlling with their parts. Like, I get that. You go to replace your Tesla's water pump. Or they don't have water pumps. What, what, what parts do they have? I don't know. His car is now no longer a battery-powered no, car. No, it's got like a gas engine in it. It's got a, you know, a V8, but V10. But why or... would you do that? It's, it's to fight back against the control. Right. It right. is an irrational fear of Tesla is controlling all the little SI. Therefore, I am going to take on the world. I'm going to rage and I'm going to get back at them. That's why it's irrational. To some context, as he's got a really great YouTube video yeah. where, where he does. So, so you know the guy Cody uh, Whistle and Diesel or whatever, yeah. where I like build a car and then blow it up? Yeah, yeah, This yeah. guy does the same thing minus blowing it up or not so much blowing it up. <laughs> right. that, that's why with this code, I, I, I've been telling you, start with the observers, especially the EPs, maybe the IJs, whatever, because they're so fucking nuts. They then help you do the math on all the rest, right? Yeah. So let's look, let's look at his type. So uh, he's the same type as your brother. <laughs> Such a cool picture of right, him. Right. What? <laughs> He's got the any any stripes going on. I know the eighties. The, the NTPs love the fucking eighties. Exactly, reason, and you gotta cause chaos if you're like I'm funnier than you and cooler than you, which yeah, he is. He is. He, he is, is funnier. way cooler and funnier. I than, just said that. Than all of us. So um, other interesting things about his type, you're gonna have the double activated NE and the FE, so super double the cidery, but still the masculine TI, and so like that, that's gonna be a lot of frustration of like I gotta build it my way. Okay, so this is but super this fascinating is to me. So we talk about like little dinosaur, go this dinosaur going against that dinosaur all the time. So I think it is fascinating that he's really triggered by Elon <laughs> because yeah. Elon is TISI and that would be his that. last animal. So he would really be freaked out by that. I which, did not see that till which now. Which is ironic. That's really good. He would be triggered by Elon. <laughs> Because wow. he is controlling, yeah. you know, my way. Control. That's that's really good. All right, so this first clip is going to be him uh, just from one of his YouTube videos just saying funny shit. Physical control is the worst. So all of your fears are manifested in the government or the companies right. are, are physically controlling you. But every once in a while, I'll get in the old Model X to get an idea of what the future is supposed to be. Someone <laughs> described the future perfectly. The year is 2040. You're eating from your weekly ration tube of cricket paste in your self-driving electric car that only allows you to get it from work and back at the speed limit. You get home and you're greeted by your non-binary they friend as your child comes in saying thinking is a crime. Well, it's time to get in my self-driving car. Oh, the air suspension compressor failed. The vehicle will not raise. Let's take it to Tesla. Open the app, set up an appointment. The nearest service center is not taking okay. appointments for a month, so I have to drive to one that's 25 miles away. No big deal because I have a portion at 11. <laughs> Just nonstop. <laughs> it was like 25 minutes of hold on to your seatbelts. I know, that. right? Yeah. Like, we all have those frustrations. I know me as an observer, I also have that same kind of fear of like, oh, this control chaos thing. Yeah. Which is why like, if you ask me, the more I've like been watching the code and like watching people and interacting with people and like what their problems are. Because somebody will come to you or you'll come to yourself. You're like, I have this problem, this problem, this problem. It all starts with like this very complicated math at the top, right? Right. And then you get down a little bit lower. You're like, okay, what's this really about? You're like, well, right. I'm really worried about this or I'm afraid of that. And then it kind of drops down to more of a, a simpler, irrational, subjective fear, but it's really not that one guy or that one thing, right? right. You, get, you get out of the details. And then when you divide it down again, it really does keep coming down to observer decider stuff in the sense of wow. not double observing or not double deciding. So in the sense of when I'm listening to his fears, I'm like, Look, you, you got to switch the, the math around a little bit, but that, that is very much what my fear is as For an observer. Sure. And I see with other observers as well. What started happening over time was Tesla kind of pulled the reins in on ordering parts for cars. If I want to order like a battery or a motor, a battery, a motor, a charger, I can't do those things. Like those are restricted parts. You can't restricted do that. So what that part. tells me is that the product that I bought, the product I spent all this money on, I can't, I don't really own it. Right. Because they're in control of the parts for it. Like an iPhone. Correct. They're yes, exactly like an iPhone. Over time, it got worse and worse. Over time, it's like, well, well, what's the what's the VIN number to this car? Oh, we don't we're not, we don't believe in selling you these parts. This this isn't going to work. That car is a salvage car. You can't do it. And I said to myself, you know what? What um, what can I do to this vehicle to make it so that I can get parts easy and it's easy to service and I have full control over it? There isn't a single control. part sold for those cars there. If I break down the V8 Tesla, you pull me anywhere. I could get uh, pistons, rods, you name it, lifters, valves for that car, literally anywhere, and I have full control over it. That's it. That's so funny to me. Just why am I causing so much chaos to avoid chaos? But that's all it was. Why is he putting himself through so much control to avoid control? Because the amount of SI that he now has to do to oh, own that's... these cars is, you're, you know, you're rebuilding an entire machine. Why? So that you're not controlled? That is so insane. And, and that is what I see with the deciders. I see them causing right. themselves so much pain Tribe hell. to Tribe. avoid pain. <laughs>
No. Oh, God. I, I will annihilate the tribe to have my perspective, my own personal perspective respected. You know, therefore, I burn down everyone right. so that I get zero respect. I get zero connection even though that was what I was going right, for. Right, right. So, 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 like, I'll get pulled into the observer stuff. And yeah. so I'll, I have to do the math on the decider stuff. So all I'm yelling at the deciders is, like, let it go, dick. I know. Like, you get one fight a year. One fight a decade. Is this where you want to cash out? Right. Is this the one fight you want to pause your life? No, he's doing really good because he's making a fucking show out of it. That. And he's kind of owning it, too. He's like, I know this is crazy. Yes. So, like, don't take this too literally. But it's like, do you really want to fight and die? Or do you want to let it go? Because I'm really finding the more I'm like, oh, there's something, like, for me, it's like the news. It's like, oh, global warming. Oh, the Chinese. Oh, they're going to invade Taiwan. Oh, the, the currency. It's like, I'm like, uh, I'm like yes, hold on. Right. Hold on. Do I, Is this where I want to go all in? Aliens. Aliens again. Like, Spend as, all your money. As we're putting on makeup, I'm like, so the kids in South Africa in 1994 <laughs> that were visited by aliens, there was three of them. One was jumping rather slowly. And Look at Elon Musk. The only reason Elon Musk is even developing the Tesla in the first place is because of his neuroticism. There's a weird fear in there. Therefore, dot, 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 you get a Tesla. So yeah. like the neuroticism that the demon functions cause then creates technology. Like that's right. how we keep moving forward yes, is right? that neuroticism. So the thing is, it's like, don't stop doing that because then we don't get progress. Then you're, then you're zen. But I love the way that Rich is managing it because he's like, I know that I'm such a nut that I'm going to do a whole YouTube video about this. Like, yes, that's great. Right, there you're you right. Because it then, it then produces a great YouTube Yes, video. yes. And, and, then, and a great car. Like for, for all we know, it's because of Rich that Tesla is now available to me. Right. Thank you, Rich. Right. I guess so all we're saying though is like with this code stuff there's a weird balance of like you can't not do your functions and it's right. also good that you do because then you create all these benefits yes. and discoveries <laughs> for the species now you're gonna die alone miserable and an yeah, alcoholic because you think your shit is real yes. to the fucking dying true, day true yeah. the thing that I'm seeing with him is like look absolutely he might burn down because he he did that but the species benefits right. from it well here's some beneficial uh, species adaptation uh, with the AI bots that you were all so afraid of does have junk. <laughs> they made him not have junk because he has junk. goes wrong. Why is it always got to go wrong? It's going so good it went wrong. <laughs>